How mad would you be if I gave you something from Bath and Body Works and Gucci? <laughs> Hey, what's up everyone? It's Fear Blind Chick back on your screen with another vlog. It's Sunday, it's sunny, it's beautiful. Don't let the light fool you, it's freezing out there. You saw the little, it wasn't even a montage, that was like 30 seconds of what, but I was trying to do something with it. Anyways, I was at the Eaton Center this morning because I had to do a couple returns and a couple purchases. I got some Lush ran out of the paper bags that say Lush on the side, that's okay. I'm gonna wrap it in cellophane anyway. Actually, this one I might use for myself tonight. I need a little R&R, &R. okay. But this one is a gift, I'll show you. I'm so excited. It's called Golden Pear. It's light scented, it smells so good. This is a seasonal one. My friend once gave me a soap in the same smell. Heavenly. One of the things I went to return, you guys might have seen at the beginning of the month, it was this turtleneck, which I thought would have been a whole vibe, but one, it's kind of see-through. And two, it's just not giving what it needs to, so I wanted to return it, but look, I left the receipt right here. So when I went to the store, the girl's like, you can go back to the exact store you got it from because they'll have it on the file. And you know, I was on the way to the second store and I was like, I just, I don't feel like it anymore. I knew I needed to come back. I'm supposed to film, but the way the sunlight is coming in, I'm probably gonna leave that for tomorrow. And then guess what? Tomorrow's gonna be overcast. I'm gonna wish that I did it today. Anyway, when I was at the door, you saw, this is the weekend that all my Black Friday stuff came in because I ordered this before Black Friday, ordered this, I think, on Black Friday. It's just like Christmas came early. Guys, look at this. It's like a little snowball. <gasps> okay, so why is it dirty though? Because it's brand new. Excuse me, sir. What, what, what's going on here? I guess it really does attract dirt. And remember, I saw this in the store and the lady was like, Wait, is my soup done yet? Jeff made me this huge tub of soup. So sweet. Got good friends. Oh, my bra was showing all this time? Sorry guys. I saw this ball in the store, but it was dirty and I'm like, no thank you. And they're like, oh, it's an online return. There's no more, but we can order you one free of charge. And the duties at Anthropology are kind of expensive when you order online. I don't think there's duties attached to this either, but there's a lot of weird ish attached to it. I don't know what this is. I guess whatever was in the bag, but there shouldn't have been anything in the bag. Someone rolled this in hay before they packaged it for me. Well, this top passed the pill test because I wore it underneath the sweater today and it was okay. Good on you, Naked Wardrobe. I love it. It's just like a big ball in my sofa. I want to get rid of the pillows that I made that I DIY'd years ago because they've never been it. I don't know who I was trying to convince. <laughs> started editing this vlog and I already want to take a break. Back in the frame but not being in the frame. <laughs> I'm editing last week's vlog, which will be up by the time you're watching this. It's only an hour and a half of footage. I'm so excited. You know how hard it is to get two or three hours of footage down to 20 or 30 minutes? That's what I usually do every week. But this week it's an hour and a half, which I can easily get down to 30 minutes or less. And I don't know what I did this week if I already knew that I didn't want to be in the predicament I was in last week or the week before and I just captured less or I lost footage because that happens all the time and sometimes while I'm editing I'm like no it was actually something sentimental I wanted to share with you guys you can't recreate that plus as a vlog you kind of just go with the flow right so ooh, my hair is really really dry dang that's what happens when you wash it every day I'm not supposed to wash curly hair every day but that's the only way I refresh my curls in order to have my curls popping for the vlogs I have to brush it. In order to brush my hair, it needs to be soaking wet. Otherwise, it would snap and break and snag. So I made an appointment earlier today for later on this week so that my hair can be straight and I can leave it alone for a bit because this feels like straw. Yeah. 
Even the sound of it is so peaceful. How did all my bananas turn in two days? It's not that hot in here. Actually, I'm freezing cold. It's a Monday. I'm so happy I'm not going to a job I hate. I'm very, very grateful to be wrapping up the year this way. And then hopefully in January, we start fresh with something brand new, out of the box. A way to be gainfully employed that just fills my heart with joy. That sounds so nerdy and tacky and whatever. But really, I actually had a dream about a job and I was like, oh, that would be a good job for me. And I'm someone who's never known what I wanted to be. You know, when you're little, you're like, I want to grow up and be a blah, 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 blah. I had no idea. Wow. This matcha smells so gross. It's the eggnog one I told you guys about. Never wanted to be like the typical three, doctor, lawyer, teacher. I wanted to be an orthodontist and a dermatologist. Then my auntie talked me out of both of them. Do you really want to see nasty things on people's skin all day? Because when I thought about being a dermatologist, I'm like, I'm going to help people get clear skin because I had clear skin as a teen and then it just around 25. Seriously, I would have rather had bad skin when everyone else did. Then I realized dermatologists see people for skin cancer and different lesions and rashes and bacteria growth. And no, 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 no. Moral of the story is I wanted to be very few things and none of those things I really, really felt matched me. But the dream I had last night, I felt like, oh, you know what, I could do that. So I'm gonna see if there's any postings for that. And you know what else I'm gonna post? My site series. I'm so excited. So if you guys don't know, I made a site series a few months ago. In October, I filmed eight videos, four intro, four advanced on how to live life legally blind. Everything from mentally to lifestyle, romance, friendship, what you say when you're in a job interview, what you ask for when you're at a job, the assistive devices that are out there to help you. I answered it all in this four part series, whether your intro as in if you're new to Life Legally Blind, if you're not blind yet, or you've been living with it for some time. I had two separate sets of videos for you that I'm gonna launch today finally on YouTube now that I'm a member. And they're also gonna be available on Patreon too, so you can check out there to see what the prices are and see what's up. I'm so excited to launch it. I can't believe I've had it on my hard drive for two months. Talk about procrastination. Mondays are my busiest day. I gotta do my two pods for tomorrow, launch the four videos for the intro site series. Meanwhile, I got filmed today. No wait, today's video is weekly vlog. I gotta edit the vlog, which is gonna take at least two more hours. And I'm gonna film 21 things that happened in 2021. Hopefully I come up with a better title than that by the time this video is up, which is tomorrow, because I want it to be on the 21st. Somebody gotta step up, girl, man. Somebody so let it go. Tuesday. It's 11.15. I should already be at the salon because that's when my appointment begins. I need to get this hair situated, so let's go. Christine Tower. This is what I get for trying to walk and show you guys. This is my hair. So much better. She trimmed a lot off, but it needed to go. It feels so soft now. There's crumbs. This plant needs to be watered. Oh my gosh, I've been neglecting them so badly. Oh, sorry, didn't see you there. I'm so extra with it. So what do you think of the hair? She cut off about two inches. Feels so much healthier. It's slowly growing. I mean, it would be longer if it wasn't cut, but... I don't need them raggedy ends anyway. So I'm so happy that she did a deep treatment because my hair needed it. My hair feels so thin. When I go back to curly, I can't be combing it every day again. That's a no-no. I hope you guys could hear my intro. I realized when I was walking, oh shoot, maybe it's too loud with everything going around. Hopefully by the end of this week slash beginning of next week, we get that sorted out. But uh, now I gotta film two videos today. That's why I put my face on. I'm gonna put lip gloss on after I eat lunch. So I'll check in with you guys in a bit. P.S. Look what I just discovered. I'm such a bad plant mom. I don't know if it's because I only have it turned to one side when the sunlight's coming in, so it's not getting enough on this side, or if that's because that's the side 
that faces the heat. <sighs> do I need the, mm, I think I need to turn the light off to do the B-roll. Ooh, what a mess. What a mess, what a mess, what am I, ooh, what am I doing tonight? Taco Tuesday turned out good. Sorry, I didn't show you guys, but to film and move around, it was faster to cook. I'm gonna do the B-roll now for tomorrow's video. The last time I tried to do this, it was focusing on the plants and not the Prosecco. Something about the having the oven open is all types of unsafe, but we're just gonna go through it. Ugh, my hair is a mess, but okay. Vlog life is real life, okay. Ugh. Let me turn off this light. So it looks like it did when I was filming the sit down vid. Are we in focus? Let's see. Let's check. Yep, zoomed all the way up, it's good to go. The last time I poured this, I poured everywhere but the glass. Pray for me. Oh my gosh, she's doing it. <laughs> Afternoon, it's noon on the dot. Where did the sun go? I woke up this morning, it was so sunny and perfect for the video I'm trying to film today. Get ready with me. And then, boom, Mother Nature's like, oh yeah, you wanna do that? Now you have to set up your softbox. So, the thing about doing makeup with the lights on, <sighs> it's gonna be a lot of editing and post, bro, but gotta roll with them punches. Today, on the roster, besides filming two videos, is I'm going to get some stuff from Metro to make a shakuri board. Later tonight, I'll do my actual big grocery shop at No Frills, save some coin. And there's something else I wanted to do. I'm craving a roti, so I'll probably go and get one of those. Look what arrived. I'll show you in a second. Let me put that down here. There's a lot going on everywhere. I'm still set up from earlier today because I have to get right back to filming. I gotta do part two for tomorrow's video. And luckily I got the ingredients to do part one just now. My house is kinda messy and my friend is visiting me in 10 minutes. Okay. There we go. Might as well finish this part too. What should she wear? Hey, 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 hey. This is how you know I have too much energy. No one person should be this excited for some crackers. Oops, what's that? Cheese. All butters for bacon later. And then I got my cold cuts. That lady was not having a good day working behind the counter. I'm gonna pray for her. Quick fall to you ball haul. I ordered this a while ago. The building manager was saying that there were so many other orders from Hudson Bay. I guess everyone caught on to the sale they were having. This towel's not that nice. I'm gonna send it back. It's definitely not as plush as the other. Oh, actually, it's not that bad. But hey, I want more of them Calvin Klein ones that I had. Mm -mm. This one, I'm going for the hotel aesthetic with the white towels here, but they're not that. Ooh, it's huge though. It's huge but it's very thin. It had a big, big sale, but this might not be worth it. And then, as mentioned, the second package from a month ago, thank God I didn't need this in between then and now. I make it weird though, you really have to plan to get your package three to four weeks. And you pay $25 for express shipping. Express who, where, why, what, no. So when they got 50% off, I said, I only wanna get the other things that I didn't wanna get because my cart was already really hot there. Oh. I definitely didn't see that detail. I don't like this. I don't like this, not one bit. Oh, shucks. I thought these were full velvet. They're velvet and mesh. Why? <laughs> this is not my vibe. Now I regret these so much. Is that on the inside or the outside? It's on the outside. That is so tacky. These were supposed to replace my American Apparel velvet leggings that I nearly wore to shreds. I had those for 10 years, like no exaggeration. And the knees are starting to look really bad, but those are not the aesthetic I was going for. Oh, I'm so annoyed about that. Let's see if these are any better. So this is from their butter collection. Slight flare, they're not doing too much, you see. I'll have to see these on, but now that I know the velvets were messed up, I didn't even really need these. What a waste. 
Ooh, but this waist is tight. I like that. I like that. I need the cinch. Okay, well, we'll see when I try them on and I style them for you guys. But those pants were so disappointing. To send them back is probably gonna cost more than what they cost. Oh, this is when I picked up. Great, naturally. Did I get blue cheese? Yes, I did. So prosata. Some, I don't know, prosciutto. I think I got red pepper. Salami. I'll move this closer. Oh my rag, I need to wipe this countertop. And you know what I forgot. Oh my god. Ta da! Okay, reach your hand in. You grab what? What are you grabbing? Anything. You can grab a piece of meat, you can grab a cracker, you can grab cheese. You're so extra. What's <laughs> that? Brie is a soft cheese. It's not soft enough. It's it is? Blue cheese. Gorgonzola. I don't know what that is, so I'm going to take a little piece. You very little. You probably don't like it. It's sour. Do? Mm -hmm. So ham. This one is spicy sopressata. Not that spicy. Beef? Yeah. Turkey? Never that. <laughs> <laughs> You're brave for eating it. I didn't think you'd like it. A little hot chocolate. I'm so excited. After the catastrophe I caused in the kitchen, this better taste good. Let's see. Oat milk. Tiny splash of red velvet bay leaves. I, you can hear you snickering in the back. Rude. You keep things interesting. Huh? You keep things interesting. <laughs> what are you still singing? Are you the sixth Backstreet Boy? Are you the six Backstreet Boys? Are you the six Backstreet Boys? Send this one back to the streets! Hey, send this one back to the street right back. Tonight I felt like soup, so I made it. Shipping more and more. They don't make them like this anymore. Hey babies, <laughs> I'm so noxious. So last night was so much fun between making the shakuri board, filming the video for tomorrow, or is that today's video? I've lost track. I think that's tomorrow's, cause today's a get ready with me, which isn't as interesting as I thought it would be. So sorry guys, I was, whew, I slept for 10 hours, 10 hours. Where they do that at? I knew I was tired, but that's crazy. You notice this is crazy? The fact that I washed this twice and it's still not clean. The soup was so good. I already showed you guys how to make it in several videos, which is why I just showed you the finished product. After I ate it, brushed my teeth, lied down, zonked out. Today's gonna be a little bit of a catch-up day. Should I have an eggnog matcha latte? Nah, nah, I feel like that. I think I'll do a candy cane one. Even though that one is not that good either. The gingerbread one is the best seasonal one they came out with. But I will save that because I bought three packages of it. I'll be having gingerbread until July at this rate. Actually, three packages will probably last me two months. Today's such a sunny day. Where was this sun yesterday? I'm done filming for Vlogmas. It's just a matter of editing and uploading. I'm so excited, guys. 25 days of consecutive content while being legally blind. Why am I still snuffly? That is not a short feat or a small feat or whatever feat. Two pairs of feet. It wasn't easy, but I did it. Some of the videos I look back on, I'm like, I could have done better. I should have planned my time out better so I could have done better, but you know what? In all honesty, the vlogs get the most views still, so I'm not pressed and stressed. Some videos have 56 views. I'm like, how is that possible? I didn't buy my followers, so where's the rest of you 14K people? Eh? is not even showing. So I did a test. I have a YouTuber that I absolutely love. I stopped watching her content for the week to see if it wouldn't show up on my newsfeed. They just kept moving her box around. I said, why can't they do that for my content? No wonder my subscribers don't know when I post. Thank God I post on Instagram, but then, hmm, let me not even get started with Instagram. Let me stop chatting your ear off. This is what happens when I don't get to talk to you too much. And I talk to you too much the next day. There's no more bubbles. 
It's latte time. Let me turn off Alicia before I get copyright claimed. Working on yoga. And then like I told you guys, I did the whole tier thing for Patreon. It's kind of confusing. So if you don't get it, it's okay. I'll probably finish it and fix it by end of day. I need to upload a video. Gonna have some matcha. No, this is matcha. Gonna finish my matcha. By the time I finish it, then this cup of joe should be ready to go. Still haven't had my breakfast and it's after one o'clock. Who am I? I used to have three meals and two snacks a day. And then when I started working at that job, I would snack all day. And ever since I stopped working, I'm all over the place. So we need to get back on track with that. I have some gains and some goals for 2022. I think I'm gonna run to the store to return those towels because they're not as plush as I thought they would be. And hopefully they have more of the Calvin Klein ones so I can trade them in. And that's it. Pretty basic boring Thursday, can't lie. These pants, I'm so annoyed. Why do they have to put the mesh there? Does it look as bad as I think? Cause it, it's giving me clown vibes. Can you see? Meanwhile, I'm doing yoga poses. Yay, the elevator's back in service. It's been out of commission for the whole week. And some yogurt for my little after dinner dessert with some blueberries. Wondering if I should be decorating my gingerbread cookies. Better to do it today than to save it to tomorrow. Same way I ran to the dollar store to get some gift bags. Cause I'm like, I would leave that to Christmas Eve, wouldn't I? I'm telling you, having eggnog warm is where it's at. Sometimes I even add a little bit of water cause it's too sweet. This doesn't feel like Christmas. Is that just me? My aunt was asking if I was gonna visit this weekend, which is so weird that Christmas is on a Saturday. And I don't know, I don't think I'm gonna go cause it's really far and I don't wanna be, trying to travel to Tobacco during holiday hours. The last time I went there, I got on the wrong bus. And that was a half an hour fiasco. And the time before that, I got lost. And I've been in that neighborhood since I was a kid, cause that's where my, like that's an, around the neighborhood where my dad lived. So it's just vision loss is just a trip. The night before the night before Christmas and your girl took it upon herself. I'm just gonna literally throw bag and throw tissue. That's what I'm gonna do because this is the new age Christmas, okay? Gone are the days when I spend thousands of dollars on presents for my friends and family and then spend decades, okay, maybe not decades, but like at least an hour wrapping them each up. Like, no, just no. Everyone's getting something scented, so I'm super excited about that. I wish I could give myself these things, but I'm gonna wait until I have a job. This one. This one is everything. I want to wrap it properly, but for now, this is awesome in there. I used to love wrapping presents with all the ribbons and bows. I got all the matching bags. I'm surprised there was anything even left at Dollarama. But hey, your girl did it. I don't think you could see anything that was going on here. One gift already. Everything smells so amazing. The thing about being on such a tight budget, oh, this one I don't have a bag for. Bing bong, actually. No, that's somebody else's. I bought most of these gifts in November, so I don't even remember. Oh shoot, I do need one more bag. <sighs> Imagine if I put someone's gift in a wine bag. You always have to have extras in the cut. I could have sworn I had one more from last year. I bought so many last year. How mad would you be if I gave you something from Bath and Body Works and Gucci? <laughs> you know how excited you would be and you'd be like, rah. A candle. What should a girl wear? Look who I found on the subway. Hey. <laughs> Always with some multitasking. Trying to wipe this, wipe this. Oh, what a nice box. I didn't take it in. I didn't put it in a box like this. Oops, mm, I must have carried it the wrong way. Okay. So I got Jeff to read the card out for me that they wrote. So sweet. I love Christmas cards. And people always feel embarrassed reading their messages to me, but I'm like, guys, it's easier than me struggling. Hello. So my first Christmas card of the season, because I haven't seen anybody. And I didn't give out any Christmas cards this year because I left them all at my mom's place. So there's that. I'm gonna see her and my brother tomorrow. It's so mild, I definitely overdressed today. Whoop, <clears throat> free show for everybody. This is the new limitations. We may not see each other for the rest of the holidays. So we made a little, party for one in a package, which I thought was so smart. He's like, if you ever want to do a Zoom call, you have everything you need. I'm like, aw, that makes me want to cry. I also got some really sad news this morning. That did make me cry. <laughs>
disaster in my kitchen. <laughs> Morning loves, Merry Christmas. I'm not really feeling festive. This is my mood today. Maybe I'll put on a better outfit when I go to my mom's. But right now we're gonna make some pancakes because I haven't made pancakes in years. And I bought regular Schmegler milk, so you know I don't drink milk, oat milk all the way, to make some, should I dye them? Should I be extra and dye them red and green? Do I have time for that? I still gotta upload today's video. My cramps are killing me, but hopefully once I take an Advil, I'll be a-okay. I don't know if I will bring you guys with, cause I think I just wanna enjoy the moment with my family. Pancakes, is it double the powder and split the soda? I always forget the measurements. Last time I didn't realize that I was using salted butter, so I added salt to the mix. Those were some salty waffles. Some of them are burnt, but don't watch that. I'm actually very proud at how fluffy they turn. They're kind of dense. Maybe I should whisk them a little more or less. I don't know. I haven't made pancakes in two years, so this is not bad. In the time that I made these pancakes, I filmed two TikToks, talked to two family members just to wish them happy holidays, cleaned up, because you know me, I can't eat if my kitchen is dirty. That's just a no. And now it's two o'clock. So my video's got to upload. I was supposed to have it scheduled for two, but now it's uploading at two. And then I'm gonna get ready to go soon because I'm sure my mom's gonna be expecting me. So I'm gonna put these away because actually my plate is over here. You see the one that got a little crispy? I should have made them gingerbread flavored. I have a little bit of molasses left. I have all the other spices. Well, bing bong, too late for that. Was that not even in the angle all this time? Look at this, hello. I hate when there's a frog in my throat. It's the worst feeling ever. Okay, so as you guys can tell, I'm back home. I didn't show you anything. Like I told you, I just wanted to have a little QT with the family. Oh, this right here, my mom gave it to me. Isn't it pretty? <sighs> and my brother gave me this candle. He knows me so well, coconut. Mm, I can't wait to burn this, especially since my endless weekend is almost done. I've had that candle for so many years. Anyways, I'm gonna call it a night, so we're gonna wrap up the vlog here. I hope that you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, you know what to do. Tap the like, subscribe, and share. I hope that you had a Merry Christmas. Hopefully this will be up on Sunday instead of Monday, and you guys can let me know how your Boxing Day is going. But until tomorrow, aka next week, stay blessed, stay safe, stay sane. Love you later. I'm gonna go shower and sleep, man. It's not even eight o'clock. That's the crazy part.